Good evening folks, 21st Century Caveman here. Hope everybody's safe, hope everybody's well, and welcome to the third episode in the series, how to make a very strong, cheap, modern fence using decking boards. So in this series, we're actually making our own fence panels, and today we're looking at the first stage of the assembly process, installing the uprights. So as you can see the concrete posts have already been installed, in fact they were installed about a week ago and they're set very nicely. So basically then the uprights will be secured to the concrete posts and the decking boards will be secured to the uprights and the decking boards are going to be laid horizontally. So as far as the timber is concerned for the uprights we're using C16 construction grade timber and these are two to threes, so basically 50 by 75 mil or thereabouts. Now these were purchased in lengths 4.2 meters and basically we've just cut them to size. And we've also stained these with two or three coats of a decking stain. And we've used the screw fix no nonsense decking stain. Now you will have noted that the concrete posts already have a couple of pre-drilled holes at the top and the bottom, but I'll be adding another hole in the middle and also some extra holes on the other side of the post so basically we're not fixing two uprights in the same hole. Now I'll be plugging the holes using conventional plugs and packing them out where necessary but in a situation like this where the holes are very big and I don't have plugs which are big enough I'm basically just going to be making my own and to do that I'll just be folding up some electrical cable stuffing it in the hole and these do make brilliant plugs and are very effective indeed. So as far as the additional holes are concerned, I'll be drilling these using my Titan SDS Plus drill. And this is a very powerful, very effective drill and is ideal for applications like this. And to fix the timber uprights to the concrete posts, I'll be securing these using 100mm turbo gold screws from Screwfix and I'll be fixing these using my impact driver. So you can see what we're doing here, look, these concrete posts have a recess either side and we'll be fixing one timber upright to each of those recesses.
There we go, look, jobs are good and they are fixed very securely indeed. Now there is an easy and hard way of fixing the uprights to these posts and we tried a couple of methods. The first method was actually holding the timber uprights to the concrete posts, then drilling a hole through the timber, marking the concrete underneath and then drilling the concrete. That worked perfectly because we were able to screw easily into the holes in the concrete post. However, in order to try and save a little bit of time, I also tried another method whereby I basically just drilled into the concrete posts, mark where the holes were using a pencil, and then attempted to screw through the timber into the hole. But the problem with this is the fact that it could be quite hard to actually get the screw into the hole. And when you're screwing through a three inch piece of timber basically, sometimes the water does deviate the screw. And this is a good example where I tried several times to get the screw into the plugged hole and you know it just didn't work. So what I ended up doing was just basically drilling into the timber using a, using a drill piece which meant that I was able to get into the hole a lot easier but it did take time. So definitely lessons learned here. If you want to attach timber to a concrete post like this, drill through the timber, mark the concrete underneath, then drill the concrete hole, plug it and you can fix it very easily and very quickly indeed. Okay folks, so look, we've made good progress. All of the uprights have been secured to the concrete posts. So please join me in the next episode whereby we will be dealing with the decking boards. So we'll be measuring up, cutting them down to size, treating them with the decking stain, and then we'll be fixing them to the uprights and the fence will start to come together and start looking like a proper fence. And depending on how much progress we make, we may or may not be fixing them on the same day. But look, I do appreciate you watching. I hope you found this series interesting. You take care and have a good day where you are.